One-eyed. Snowser. Entertainment. Woo! Great. <laughs>Hello everyone, this is Lazy Boredom, aka Jared, from One Side Snazzer Entertainment, and today we're going to be starting a new series called Classic Full Play, and for the very first game I'm going to be doing the Classic Full Play, it'll be Yu-Gi-Oh! Forbidden Memories, old PlayStation 1 game, about Yu-Gi-Oh! that though it's more like the very first yeah, the very first season than any other game out there, I'm pretty sure. And by first season, I mean where they completely throw the rules out the window and like, eh, whatever. I'm pretty sure the reason why that was the way it was, because the show came out before the actual game, or the actual trading card game rules were set, so the show makers were just like, well, we don't have anything to go off of, so whatever, fuck it. And so... As we all know, Yugi attacks magic cards, he combines Catapult Turtle and Guy the Fierce Knight to attack a flying card, Wing Beast units have units. Been playing too much League of Legends. But Wing Beasts have an advantage of warriors, etc, etc. Of course, we're going with Jirid, because Lazy Boredom's too big to fit. You know, so I can't duel myself. For some reason. Oh shit. Let's get into the serious part of this game. That is some very fabulous purple, sir. Oh god, he's found it. This porn stash. Oh nope, never mind. Hieroglyphics. Close enough. Ah. Oh. Title drop. Ah, oh, blue dude. Let's do it. Damn right I am. What, you have problems? You don't like common people? Just wait until the common people hear about this. Yeah, that's what I thought. You know what? I'm getting away from your elite ass. Get the hell out of here. Damn right I'm gone. Duel grounds. Where, el where else will I go to duel? Well, besides the duel grounds. It's ancient Taya. Yep, got a duel. Alright, let's take a look at this deck here. Two mushroom men. I already won this game. You know, back when I first saw this card, I thought the card was about the two monsters, the, yeah, the two dinosaurs together. Apparently, it's just the brown one. And for some reason, I thought they were combined or something or another. Yes, the scroll. The shadow who something's the dark. Fire grass. So fiery, it's grass. Wing Cleaver. Japanese name. <laughs> Ah uh, yes, the stone ar the stone armadillo. Ah, <laughs> uh, apparently they had Texans do their translations. The furious sea king. Look at that face. He ain't happy at all. Unknown warrior of fiend. <laughs> Raise body heat. Yummy. That dark hole card, suck it. Yeah. Bone mouse. Tenderness. Prepare to get tenderized. 
Ah, oh, I used that joke too early, damn it. <laughs> oh well. Obese Marmot of Nefariousness. That's a very long title for a very for a very obese marmot. Well, let's get to the duel one. Very plain duel. Oh yeah, that's that easy. So the rules go as such. You can only play down one card at a time, regardless of if it's a magic or trap card. So no slapping down five trap cards, throwing down one monster in defense mode, and then practically leave it, keeping that monster alive for the next three turns out of trap cards. And polymerization is thrown out the window. Combine whatever the fuck you want. Oh yeah. The most fun thing you can do is this. Face down attack mode, bitches. Because why the fuck not? And yes, the CPU just did that. And yes, and there's another setup to this game. That give, it's called Guardian Stars. I don't know, I remember the exact concept, but Guardian Stars. Each monster has a set of two, like Mr. Starboy here has Neptune and Mars, you select one, and it's like a circular rock, paper, scissors. One that's very hard to remember, and the one, only one I remember is Sun Beats Moon. So let's get this underway. And yes, Taya is just as bad as she is in the show. That's another thing. You draw to your heart's content, so release up to five cards. So if I spam all five of these cards out on the field at one time, I get all five cards back. And once you run out of cards, it's game. But you know, another thing to note: no effects at all. So many eater bug is absolutely useless in this game, and so are many cards. It's, it's really. Watered down, essentially, it's just... Oh yeah! Got one to work. Miko gal! She's a gal? Who's a cat lady? Oh, what's this? I press square instead of X, oh no! Oh, what's this? 3D Battle Arena? This must have blown a bunch of 11 year old mind when they first got this game. She just lick her hand. This is no time for interpretive dance, woman. You're in a battle. That's what you get for doing interpretive dance instead of fighting. Ah, oh, double somersault for the victory. Another thing. Boom! The cards burst into flames. So yeah, I'll probably be just doing one of those a game. Because I don't want to... You don't... Neither you or I want to stay here for 10 minutes through every single animation. Oh no! Oh shit! Boom! So yeah, if they have advantageous... Advantageous... Guardian Star, they get 500 attack and defense. Does the Machine Fairy make anything? Probably not. Nope. Tenderness. I will probably be using that tenderized joke in like the last part. I blew my load too soon. I always thought that was a snail, but it is in fact a worm. Wait a minute. Hang on a second. 
Oh, I, okay, never mind. Dinosaur died. Um, this might make something. It does. Bolt S cargo. Apparent. That sound. That's very much like a French cuisine. If they electrified X cargo, which would be kind of interesting, if you ask me. Boom. Yep, that's what the AI always does if they're losing. Just slap down cards in face down defense mode. Now it's dark time. And I fucked over one of my cards. Nobody ever said I was a brilliant strategist. Boom! Victory! Yeah. Yeah, and you get C ranks, or ranks based on how well you do. Those spoiled, those star chips are for, um, cheating your way to really good cards, but, you know. It's like, I believe, like, a blue eyes is like 9,999, or it's 99,999. Which, as you noticed, I only got two there. The max you can get is five. Imagine how many games it would take, or how many duels it would take to get to that many. Hmm. Screw it, why not? Oh yeah, let's play, get it. Anyways, yeah, probably be skipping the next dude and getting the good card off the old guy, and that'll be it. That'll be it, and we'll keep going on the story. Uh, let's see here. Rock Beast. Rock Beast. I think that makes something. Nope. Usually you can tell your spell, well, at least in the future duels, you'll see when I'm about to get fucked when they actually pick a specific card out of their hand. For the most part, the CPU will just pick the first card in their hand, just lay it down and do that. Put it down in face down defense mode. Uh, let's see here. Do I have anything I can combine? Bone Mouse, Cyber Step. Bone Mouse, Cyber Step. Zombie Robots, let's go! Nope, no zombie robots. What a shame for us all. Let's get Cyberstein some screen time, shall we? Oh no, not a cute little Karibo! Whoa, buddy. This is a kid's game. Missile explosion! He's doing a handstand! Give that man five points! Boom! And Karibo's up in flames. I'm tempted to see, do that just so I can see how fat the Marmot is. So I really want to see how fat he is. Dragon. Thunder Dragon! Yes! Boom! Ha! Didn't mean that way at all, but still, Thunder Dragon! Let's see how obese he is. Is he like American on Rascal fat or cannot even get out of bed fat? Look how big that circle. Oh, he's. That's some qu pretty good acrobatics for apparently. for something that's apparently obese. Boom! Eat the acorn! He just slapped his shit with an acorn. How does it feel to get smacked by a baby tree? So yeah, he's not very obese at all. Hey, 
And you just slapped the shit out of a skeleton in a robe. Maybe a bathrobe. Who knows? Another interesting thing to note is the Guardian Star effects. Oh god, no, not the beast, Marmot! You son of a bitch! But, anyways, another thing to note is the Guardian Star effects, what attack they use during those scenes. Turtle Raccoon! Let's make ourselves a Cyber Wolf. Giga Tech Wolf. Close enough. I think this cart, the Sinister Serpent, is still banned in competitive play today. Although I'm not entirely sure with all this XYZ, syn what is it called? Synchro Summon crap, so. But, as far as I remember, Sinister Serpent was banned for like 10 years. We got a whole lot of useless crap. See, you want to have lightning, rock, robot, zombie, and a couple other specific types of cards. Like, because they are really good for fusion materials, but cards like Fiend, Aqua, because this is apparently Mexico, an insect you can't even make anything with, so... Let's go ahead and just spam everything together and hope for a better hand. Jupiter! That is quite a disgusting creature. Um, the thing's head's really fucked up, I think. Because its eyes, like, really far away from its snout. I don't know. It just looked weird, I guess. Oh, hey, I won. Cool. Muyan Curry. And an S rank. Booyah. A power S rank. Yeah, maybe some other time. Probably not. Uh, no thanks, buddy. And this is the first duel that's actually kind of challenging. Not really challenging, but you know. Uh, new card, Muyon Curry. Ooh, 200! Oh, I can use that all the time! Not really. It would be useful if I could put down more than one card at a time, which I can't, so... I'm pretty sure this game limits how many... I don't know how many life points you can have at one time, but I don't remember because I never actually used cards like that, so... Hmm... Dinosaur Warrior. Dinosaur Warrior. Ah, this is a pretty shitty hand. I know this makes something though, so let's do that. Boom! Bean Soldier! He's a bean who's a soldier! He's gonna green bean you all over the face! Usually he's pretty challenging, I don't know. I don't know if they're strong enough, because when you combine certain monsters they have to be high enough look attack points to fuse into certain monsters. So let's see if this works. Nope. It has to be higher. And it might be dragon and grass. And not dinosaur and grass. Oh well. Stone armadillo! I just defeated that armadillo. Took him to the ground. White magician hat. Yeah, this is a lot. This has a lot of English. Prepare your English meters. Oh, now let's just go for a better hand. And yes, the CPU will in fact attack my monst the defense mode monsters if they have a high enough attack. They don't give a shit if you're going to retaliate with actual life point damage or not. God, I need to get rid of with all the, these other cards. Bean Soldier, attack! Monster Turtle! 
Is it controls? Yeah, it is. Huh. That was so compressed, I couldn't read it off the card. Oh, god damn it. And Liquid Beast destroys the thing that controls the dark. How unfortunate. Moose A. Being soldier would not. Muse A. I don't know why. That was English and I completely fucked it up. Uh, let's get rid of these cards. Ba dink, ba dink. Fence mode, please. Boom! Bean soldier! Wrecking your face! The monster turtle attacks! Oh, uh, let's see here. Big attack wolf. Ooh, I know what you can make. Flower wolf! Boom! Flower wolf to the rescue! Not my raccoon, that's also a turtle! Why didn't you just use your turtle shell to defend? I completely forget what... How to use fairy types. Or maybe I don't. Hmm... Queen of Autumn Leaves, Bean Soldier, Flower Wolf. Which would look more impressive? Mean soldier it is! Get ready to get destroyed, wood remains! Aren't wood remains just logs? Oh, he's gonna be a very small... creature. That's a tiny ass sword. I don't think I can call it a sword, I think it's a dagger. Boom! Not even using the sword. Just get kicked to the face, you wood remains. You pathetic looking monster. Oh yeah, that 360 jump up in the air. Too legit. To photosynthesize. Get wrecked, old man! Flower Wolf for the victory. You win! Damn right I do, I always win. The little swordsman of Ayo. I'm pretty sure that's the little boy in the hood that's with a lizard of some sort. Nope, guess not. Time to go outside. Jono. Very close to Juno. Good thing that isn't a typo, because that would mean it's a very feminine name. Oh yeah, everything was more wholesome when you were a kid. Back in my day, we had white picket fences, and everybody worked. We didn't have none of your damn hippies. I guess. <laughs> you know the joy from the show, I can't believe it either. <laughs> and just like the show, he's getting his ass kicked by Seto. I think his name's Seto in this, and then he turns into Kaiba later. Whoa, 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 bitch. Don't push me into anything I don't want to do. God damn it. No, please. Fuck. Hmm. We ain't no pussies around here. Let's duel his ass. Maybe. Yeah, you better run. 
I'm gonna be number one. Yeah, that's a personal victory. Just an FYI, prepare to see me lose a couple of times, cause Seto was actually, like, old guy was mildly, well, not even mildly difficult. But, screw it, why not? I'll duel you, Joey, but Seto actually has good cards. Like Gaia and... Ha! I was right, it was the little kid in the robe that with a lizard thing. Warrior type, let's get rid of one of the... Let's get rid of that zone eater. Why do I even have two of these? Well, he's better material than one of those water crap. Okay, cool. Yeah, a card a deck has to be specifically 40 cards. None of that 40 to 60 crap around here. Uh, machine warrior, I believe that makes something. Yeah, cyber soldier. It's better than my guess, which is gonna be robot soldier. Or robot warrior. I don't know. Well, nope, nope. These two should make something, though. Nope, guess not. Jupiter! And yes, Joey is just as bad as he is in the show, like I've already mentioned. He's in fact one of the one of those people who just has all those like 500 attack card monsters, and doesn't com or doesn't mix anything at all. Zombie plant. I don't know how much attack I need. It may turns into wood remains, and this should turn into the pumpkin king. I don't know if I have to make it another zombie or another plant type. Booyah! There was another plant type. Ooh, water move or whatever the hell that's, or thunder move. I think that's how it's supposed to work. Let's get him Jupiter up in here. The pumpkin, get it? Instead of pumpkin, it's king. Ah, puns. The shadow specter is about to get wrecked. Not even normal wreck, like pumpkin wrecked. Holy shit! He's a big one. He's got a UFO. Now that's not even a UFO. He might be Luffy. We got transformed into a pumpkin. It's also a zombie. Is that a straw hat? I'll oh, get whipped. That's actually mildly creepy. Oh, what's his victory? Are we sure that's not Godzilla? They got turned into a r pumpkin. That was, sounded very close to a Godzilla like noise. Speaking of Godzilla, new movie was pretty good. Kick some ass. Won't spoil anything for you. He defeats some monsters for people. Initially, they hate him. <laughs> oh, okay. Apparently, it doesn't count for pumpkin. Zombies getting fucked in the ass around here by their inability to enjoy the dark places. I just noticed that thing had soldier written on the side of its body. Cyber soldier, I mean. Machine warrior? Oh, yeah. Uh, what about fairy warrior? Let's try that. Nope. Nope. Makes a really cool sound effect when you have an advantage. Pumpkin! Wreck him! I've actually made Monster Eye not useless. What a tragedy. Plant robot. 
I'm pretty sure that's not a thing. So let's go with the op. Let's get another bean soldier out here. Get beaned! Pumpkin! And Cyber Soldier! Thirty-one minutes already. Kurogashi. Most cards I can figure out what they are when they're new Japanese names like that. I have no fucking clue. Oh boy. Oh Jesus. Didn't you just already ask me that? Alrighty, well. We're going to attempt this. If it doesn't work, end of part one. If it doesn't... Er, yes, that's how sure I'm, I'm going to lose. I said if it doesn't twice. But if it does work, we'll end it there too. Ooh, did I just get fucked in the ass? Nope. Prepare my anus, because this is going to get really rough. Or not. Well, at least I have that card. That's an awkward, that's a spellcaster card. Um, I'm just going to go ahead and get rid of all these cards, because I don't need, they're not going to help me at all. Ooh, I could have made Zombie Shark. That would have been something. Oh god, he's fusing cards. Ah, oh, I'm about to get blown. This is a butt fuck zone, that's for sure. Got Armadillo. I'm pretty sure this might make something, but first of all. Get rid of that cyber sir, or fire, whatever the hell it was. Cerberus card. Oh, you son of a bitch. And he just made pumpkin. Awesome. Ow. Seto, please. Okay. Let me, gotta think about this. Rock, grass, that doesn't make anything. Plants, rock. I don't think that makes anything either. This might make something. Let's see. Alright, what card can I make that can beat what I what he has out there? Hmm. I'm trying to think. Dragon Rock might be able to beat that. So I gotta keep him. Alright, and hope I eventually get a good card. Uh, let's mix those two last. Because I think they might. I think I've already tried it, but I'm not entirely sure. Nope. Okay. Well then. It all comes down to if I can draw the dragon scroll before I lose li all my life points. Spellcaster and water might need something. Yes! 30,000 year old white turtle saved my behind. And before he, drop, he puts down Gaia and... Okay. It'd be really nice if I could get the card I need. Before I run out of cards. Oh no. Well. Not Muse. 
Who, now who will make music for me? Ah, oh, please, game, quit fucking me in the ass. <laughs> I need that card. <laughs> really need the dragon. Okay, Jupiter. What beats Jupiter? Mars? Kratos. Yeah. I don't think that's a garden star, though. Hmm. Hmm. Oh, well. This is some serious music for serial situations. Cherubin, no! Seriously though, he has a guy with a fierce knight in his deck, and as soon as he draws that card, I'm gonna be screwed. Of course, that doesn't mean. I mean, also means I'm gonna be screwed if I can't draw. Oh hey, he does it too. <laughs> Wretched ghost of the attic, which is just a recolor of Karibo. <laughs> Yamamoto, please. Thank you. And before this doesn't work. Yeah, Stone D. Get ready to take the D to the face. Boom! Yeah! I've got five cards to do this. And I can't just not play down a card, so... Okay, I gotta do this in seven turns. I'm gonna have to take some losses here. I have to risk it that card too. Oh, 50, just 50 over. Please don't. Yes, thank you for not picking a specific card because I know that's going to be Gaia if he does. Okay, well, just put down Starboy. I might beat Seto on the first try. I can only dream. Stone Dragon! Stick your D right in his face! Got six cards. Oh no! Ugh! The sun! How does it feel, Kaiba? You're on the losing end today! He's gonna draw a guy, isn't he? Nope. Yeah! Good game, motherfucker. Mars. Stone Dragon attack his life points directly. Boom! Yeah! Suck it, Seto! Suck it! Yeah! And a D rank! I'll take it! Total annihilation! Damn right, you can't believe you lost. What is that supposed to mean? I'm pretty sure that's not Egyptian. Uh, I don't want to duel either of you anymore. <laughs> I just defeated Seto. Let's go to the shrine and save. That's not where I'm supposed to go, but okay. Oh, these motherfuckers. You'll be seeing them again in the future. Foreshadowing.
card shop where you cannot buy or sell any cards at all. You can save though. For so good for that. Or er, good on us for being able to do that. Let's return to the title. Yes. Yep, and we're back in the game. Sup? I think he ate all the cards, and that's why that's why you can't buy or sell them, any of them. Did not mean to build in my deck, but Arlo Nay. Okay, that doesn't sound like Japanese or English. Hmm. I wonder if that's a precursor to the what's her face, the Thorn Lady. Kurogashi, the insect, and Muyan Curry. Well, I think. Build deck. Not what I meant to press. Oh well. Anyways, let's go to the password. Just to show you how ridiculously costly some of these are, I'm gonna look one up real quick and show you how much a really strong card costs. <laughs> Jesus Christ! 999,999, almost 1 million star chips. You're gonna get those five at a time. Holy shit, is that inflated? That's a lot of motherfucking star chips. And you think that's unreasonable? Just wait. You should see what the nor least like normal cards have amounts wise. I think like Beaver Warrior, which is like 1200 attack, has like a thousand star chip thing on it. That's 200 perfect duels. I think. Yeah. 5 times 200 is a 1,000, right? Yeah. That's what it was, yeah. Mm -hmm. It's probably more than that, but you know what I mean. That's a lot. Still, anyways, after looking at this, you'll never see a Blue-Eyes White Dragon in my deck unless I get it through re rewards or whatever. So, well... I'll be s double saving for overriding this. And we'll call it a night. That's it for part one, everybody. See you next time.